like I said before the weather, I'm joined by Katie. How are you this morning? Hi, good. How are you? I'm great. Despite the rain, I'm still okay. <laughs> um, <laughs> so tell me a little bit about Breckenridge Grand Vacations. Um, Breckenridge Grand Vacations is a privately owned company here in town. Um, they've got four properties. They're working on, or excuse me, three completed properties. They're working on their fourth now. Um, it's going to be big and beautiful, and it's up on Peak 8. So, um, yeah. yeah. Tell me a little bit about this big and beautiful this property beautiful that's coming. <laughs> yeah, this big beautiful property. Um, it's right at the base of the gondola there. Um, best location in town in the winter. You'll have ski and ski out location. Um, in the summer, it's great. It's right next to that fun park. If you haven't been there yet, it's pretty fun. Great for little kiddos and you know adults too. Um, and it's called the the Grand Colorado on Peak Eight. We're talking all about it, but you guys don't even know what it's called. Um, so we talked a little bit about the location. How about the amenities? Amenities are going to be fantastic, definitely the best in town. Um, we're going to have outdoor, indoor and outdoor aquatic centers, on-site spa, on-site restaurant, um, game room, movie theaters, the list goes on. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Spa. Yeah. Spa. Yeah, spa. Did you mention that? I know. Okay. Oh, you said spa. spa. There's a spa. <laughs> That's what, clearly I'm excited about the spa. Yep. Um, yeah. Cool. So lots of really great amenities. It's almost like you don't even need to leave when you're on vacation. You mentioned a restaurant, a spa, indoor, outdoor pools, steps from the chairlift. Like you, you don't even need to leave. Yeah. <laughs> you could just uh, hop on a shuttle and come right here and never leave. <laughs> Shuttles that would go into town too to take you to all the great restaurants. There yeah. Too. So we talked about the location, the amenities. Tell me a little bit more about like what it's going to look like. <laughs> it's going to be pretty um, sophisticated, pretty modern. Not too high, too um, you know extreme modern, but definitely kind of what you know those beautiful finishes that are really popular now. And um, it's going to it's definitely going to be out of this world. <laughs> yeah. And if you haven't been to the Grand Colorado on Peak Seven, check out the Grand Colorado on Peak Seven because if you're going to make the Grand Colorado on Peak Eight, I feel like. It's going to be Grand Colorado. You walk into the Grand Colorado on Peak, or Grand the Lodge. Grand Lodge. On, I keep saying that. That you're like, I'm like, why is she looking at me like that? I'm calling it the wrong thing. Grand Lodge on Peak Seven. You walk in. There's this grand staircase. It's beautiful. How is it going to compare? How's the Grand Colorado on Peak Eight going to compare to the Grand Lodge on Peak Seven? <laughs> yeah, definitely. The Grand Lodge on Peak Seven currently is the best in town. I mean, if you were to head up there, it's um, you know, you could get off at the first gondola stop, check it out. It's beautiful. Um, but yeah, the Grand Colorado on Peak Eight is going to be even one step above that. So it's going to be incredible. And Good. Um, so let's talk a little bit more about Breckenridge Grand Vacations. You guys, you're really involved in the community. Tell me some more about that. Yes, we are. We are very involved with the community. We also just started a philanthropy program. It's called BGV Gives. So we help out throughout the community um, and even into Park County. So through Summit County and Park. Um, and then we also, you know, we are taking place in the parade. We're kind of everywhere. Everywhere you want to see, you know, a community player. That's kind of where we are. Cool. Are you going to be in the parade? I just the company. I am, I, I am heading up the 4th of July float, so look out for the BGV's um, Lib Lady Liberty's Luau Party. You'll see us there. <laughs> awesome. That's going to be really, really fun. So if somebody wants to find out more information about either the Grand Colorado on Peak 8, the Grand, Col the Grand Lodge on Peak 7, or more information just about Breckenridge Grand Vacations, how can they find out more? <laughs> um, our website's a really great resource, BreckenridgeGrandVacations.com. Um, otherwise, we've got a sales center just right here on Main Street. So if you're wandering around town, it's just at the intersection of Lincoln and Main. You can always just stop in and um, say hi to us. Yeah. <laughs> stop by the Grand Lodge on Peak 7. <laughs> yep. Like, what am I calling it now? Okay. <laughs> yep. If you're on your way up the gondola to the fun park or anything like that, you can always just stop on at the first stop there is the Grand Lodge on Peak 7. Cool. Yeah. Awesome. Well, Katie, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thank you guys for tuning in this morning on this rainy Friday morning. Um, that pretty much wraps things up for us here in Breckenridge. But like I said, we've been hanging out at the office of Summit Mountain Rentals. Um, check out summitrentals.com for more information. They'll help you um, rent your house. They'll help you take care of your house. They'll even just give you more information about how to maintain your home. So check out summitrentals.com for more information. But yeah, that wraps things up. Even though it's raining, still have a wonderful day. I hope you have a wonderful weekend and a great great 4th of July. We will be live from Breckenridge again next Wednesday. We'll be at Beloved Boutique right on Main Street, so make sure you tune in again. And yeah, we're going to take a short break, but don't go anywhere because Justine will be back with you in the studio.